My name is Don Thomas. I'm a songwriter. I have written songs that the church sings around the world. Songs like Anointing Following Me, uh, songs like A Shield About Me, and other songs that the Lord has blessed me to write. I was deeply touched by the terror, the fear. Uh, some weeks ago now, it's been five or six weeks that we've had to practice social distancing and to wear masks and to wear gloves and not to cough or not to even shake hands. You can cough, but you had to protect not only yourself but other people. And I felt really led by the Spirit of God to come together and sing these songs so that uh, you could join with us. We wanted to speak to the issue of terror and fear, knowing that God has not given us a spirit of fear, but of power, of love, and a sound mind. Uh, the denomination that I'm ordained in lost over 30 pastors now. That shook me. And um, I have friends who have died, close friends, uh, pa both pastors and other musicians. I particularly asked some friends of mine, uh, Jeff Smith, Jonathan Curry, Michael Thomas, who's actually my son, uh, to work with me today in putting together some songs, four of which I wrote or co-wrote with some others. Uh, I pray that you will enjoy uh, both uh, the commitment to our Lord, uh, their significant musicianship, and just our opportunity as friends to come before you and uh, uh, do these songs. And frankly, I want you to sing with us. You may not know them. If you don't know them, listen, they're easy to learn. And particularly, uh, Gregory Porter's song, Take Me to the Alley is an invitation by Christ himself out of Luke 14 to go into the highways and byways, the hedges and the alleys and the streets and invite people to come to his banquet, his table, and to his garden so that he can bring pardon to our lives. And so listen, enjoy my friends and uh, enjoy each other. Thank you. This song is called Take Me to the Alley, written by Gregory Porter. It's based on Luke 14, when Jesus tells his disciples to invite the poor, the broken, the blind, the lame, shattered the COVID-19 people who have deep fear to come to his banquet to come to his table listen to this song well they build their houses Preparation for the king, and they line the sidewalks with every sort of shiny thing they will be surprised. they hear him say take me to the alley take me to the 
afflicted ones take me to the lonely ones that somehow lost their way let them hear me say I am your friend Come to my table Come on, rest here in my garden You will have my pardon Take me to the afflicted one. Take me to the lonely one that somehow lost their way. Let them hear me. I am your friend Come on, come to my table My table I want you to rest in my garden have my pardon you will have my pardon My name is Jonathan Curry. I'm a local musician here in the Atlanta area. Um, with COVID-19, um, I think it's really doing something globally, making us really pay attention to what we have, really be 
grateful for life, for friendship, to be around family, to once again stop everything and see what's really important to us. But for me, it's been a, just a period of reflection and hope, the hope that we have. It's like now we really are expecting greatness just from stopping. It gave us a chance to stop. Um, God will work, he will work it out how he wants to work it out and when he wants to work it out. A few months ago, I got a call to do uh, a worship service with Pastor Don. Didn't really know him, didn't really know much about him. Didn't know what to expect. When I got to the church, it was something just really different. People that were there, he sort of received me in like I was always a part of the family. The music said something a little bit different than most of the gospel music that I'm used to. And just the way he related to people, the way the, the music went across, it's a little bit of a change, but I felt a true anointing in it. And I did a few, few more worship services with him, and it was always another level of musicianship, of songs, of relating to people that was still different and challenging he was speaking to like another crowd of people who are in church, people who don't do the things that we religiously do. And so when he calls to do these, it's like, I'll do it. But it's like a challenge in the music, a challenge in, in growth and worship. So when he called me for this one, it was easy to say, yes, I'll be there. Um, and I'm just hoping that when you watch this, when you hear these songs, it challenges you and pushes you to love somebody who doesn't deserve it. Some, love somebody who doesn't go to your church that does not worship, just to be enveloped. But I think these songs really ask for that. And I hope you receive it.
up in your joy. Wake up in your freedom. Hey, wake up in your joy. Hey, in the morning, in the morning, oh, joy will come. Joy will come. Joy. Jeffrey Smith, and I'm from the Atlanta area, a bassist, uh, played with several people in the area. Uh, right now, I'm experiencing playing with Don Thomas, a fantastic, great, anointed artist, and I'm grateful to be here, a part of this, this event. Uh, COVID-19 means a lot to me right now because right now my wife is not home. She's stuck in L.A., and we're waiting for things to clear up for her and my grandson to come back home. And I'm just grateful to God that she's with my daughter and her daughter, and she's safe and secure in that manner. Uh, this project means a lot to me because it's part of my testimony. And I thank God for all these songs. Little do you know, I've been uh, one that, a recipient of drugs. I, was on drugs pretty bad at one time in my life and I thank God that he delivered me from that and so I know that weeping may endure for a night but joy does come in the morning and first of all I'd like to say all of you out there this is going to be a great message for you that don't know God if you get an opportunity to, to receive this take it in and let it soak into your spirits, for God has something great for you in store.
Micah Thomas, I'm a recording engineer, producer, also I'm a drummer. This time has been a difficult time in, in America, in the world actually. Um, we have so many people who are sick with COVID-19, so many people who are quarantined, so many people who are practicing social distancing. And we wanted to do something, we want to do something that is, that will be helpful to everyone out there who's at home, everyone out there who is sick, or everyone out there who's just missing people. We wanted to do a couple of songs that would really touch the hearts of everyone out there. My dad asked me today to be a part of this and play alongside some great musicians that I've played with before, had such a great time playing with, and of course I said yes. So just pray that these songs are a blessing to each and every one of you and that you remember to keep God first in this time. Spirit is moving, Spirit is brooding over the deep parts of my life. The Spirit is moving, Spirit is brooding over the deep As the deer pants for streams of water, my soul pants after you. When can I meet with you, Lord? Oh, my tears been my food. Day and night, people are saying, The spirit is moving, the spirit is brooding over the deep parts of my life. Go deeper, Lord. The spirit is moving, the spirit is brooding, yes you are, over the deep my life why are you so down at why so disturbed with in me put your trust in God oh because deep calls to deep spirit to search all things reveal my soul I pray the spirit is moving the spirit is brooding 
over the deep heart of my life. Wash me. Spirit is moving, Jesus. The Spirit is brooding over the deep heart of my life. Over the deep
Oh 